I miss everybody. This video is intended for in ballet uh, intro level B. Of course, anybody uh, is welcome to try and to learn, um, but that's what this video is aimed at. And we're gonna work on four different skills that we would be practicing today if we were at the studio instead of cooped up in our houses. And I hope everybody is still staying safe and healthy and happy. Uh, the four skills that we're gonna go over today, two of them are skills that we've already been working on, and two of them are brand new skills um, that, again, I would be teaching if we were in class today. So I'm gonna start with the review skills. The first one is our balance. And you're gonna start in fifth position with your working leg that you're gonna start with in the back. You're gonna start with a degage. You're gonna step into a coupe plie. You're gonna replace this foot and degage and releve, coupe plie, and close. Adding the releve is new as of last week or so. Um, so just be mindful of that. Um, but this is the correct way we are building this skill from the ground up. And we're gonna do the other foot, degage. Step coupe plie, step into your degage and relevé, step coupe plie, and close. That is your balance. I will do a few again. Brush, step coupe, step degage, step coupe plie, and close. Balance. 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 And that is our balance. Again, it's a skill that we've been building on. So do be mindful um, that bits and pieces have been added at different points in time. Um, but that is the full step as it is meant to be performed. Our next review skill is our chenne turn. I'm gonna slide back a little bit as this is a locomotor movement. You want to stand in first position with our arms in first position. Find something to spot, which is staring at and keeping our eyes on it the whole time that we're turning. We're going to go to relevé and we're going to do a half turn and a half turn to complete one chenne turn. Make sure that our legs stay as close to first position as possible and our legs stay straight and our, leg, and our feet are still in that relevé position. A couple of things that I've noticed in class that we need to be mindful of is often we're so focused on getting into first position that we make adjustments. We do not need to make adjustments. We just need to make sure that our step is close to first position to begin with. In first position, instead of adjusting our feet. This is the incorrect way. This is the correct way. The other thing that I've noticed is that it's very easy for us to bend our knees and we end up like this. Once again, this is incorrect. We want to make sure that our legs are completely straight. And that is our chenne turn. And those are our two review steps. We have two new steps that we would be working on in class. The first of which is called a pirouette prep or a pirouette preparation. So we're preparing ourselves to be able to do a pirouette, which is a turn. So you're going to start in fourth position. Your back arm, your back leg, and your front arm are going to be the same. You're going to demi plie in fourth position, and you're going to go to passe en relevé, and you're going to lower back to fourth position where you began. If you are struggling getting to releve, that is okay for right now. Just like our balance that you can build onto it. And I'll show you a step down version that you can build upon. So if you struggle getting to releve the first time, you can try it on flat. Demi plie, passe to flat, and down. Once you get the hang of that, 
Then you can try the pirouette prep to rally, which I'll show again. Demi plie, pirouette prep, and down. And I'll show you on the other foot as well. My left foot is behind. My left arm is the one that's in the front. I'm going to pick up my back foot to passe en rally and replace it behind you. You notice I just hopped a little bit. You want to try not to do that. It tends to happen as we're learning or if we've lost our balance, but you do want to try to avoid that as much as possible. I'll show you that pirouette prep again. Demi plie, pirouette prep, land back in demi plie, and close. Once again, that is our pirouette prep. The other new skill that we, we would be working on is our pas de chat. And this pas de chat is a bit of a locomotor step, so I'm going to slide back a little bit. And you're going to use your passe to do a pas de chat. We're going to use two passes. You're going to start in fourth position, and arms are in first. You're going to demi plate. You're going to pick up your back foot first. You're going to do two passes. Passe, passe for your pas de chat. I'll show again. Demi plie, back foot comes up first. Two passes and then land with that same foot in the front. Pas de chat. Pas de chat. I will slide back so we can try the other foot. This time you're going to start with your left foot in the back because that's the foot that you're going to pick up first. Your arms are going to be in first position. Be sure to demi plie before and after each pas de chat as we want to plie and bend our knees before and after each and every jump. Demi plie, pas de chat, and down. Demi plie, pas de chat. Notice how I'm demi plie in here. Demi plie, pas de chat. Two passes, one and then the other. Try to keep two passes in the air at the same time. Once again, that is our pas de chat. So today we have gone over our balance. 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 We have gone over our chame turn. Chame turn. And of course that can be done to the left as well. We have also gone over our new skill, uh, a pirouette prep, which can be done without the releve to begin with if needed. Pirouette prep. And we've also gone over our pas de chasse. And I'll show the other foot as well. Alright. I hope everybody has fun continuing to dance. Even though you're by yourself, we're all with you and we all love you. We'll see you soon.